Well guys, hopefully you can see me here, but it is 4.48 in the morning and I'm going to milk cows. Boss was having some, uh, a lot of people back out over the Easter weekend for Easter stuff, so he uh, asked if I could fill in. I'm gonna go and milk here. Uh, I have two farms that I have to milk at, so we're gonna milk both of them this morning. I'll be back home by like nine o'clock, and then I'm actually gonna go back and milk the afternoon shift as well. It is pouring rain out right now. I don't really know if you can tell. Pouring rain right now. Right now, this storm that's moving through is kind of the, the front of the storm that just went through like Louisiana and Monroe and all that, all the tornadoes. So We're supposed to get some uh, thunderstorms this morning and throughout the day, so keep you guys posted. All right, we're pulling up to the farm now. Here we are. I will catch you guys when I come out of the barn in about an hour. Finished up here at 6. 21 on my way down to the other farm. So this farm that I just milked, it's like 70 some cows. Now we milk with two guys. So I'm heading down to the other farm. We're gonna get it started down there. That farm is 115 cows. Now these, both of these farms are tie stalls. Kind of a rocky, rocky pothole driveway. It's getting light out, but the uh, camera makes it way brighter than it really is. It's really weird. Car's coming. Alrighty. Finished up, it's 8.46. That took over, actually a little over two hours today. But that's because it's a morning milk and it always takes longer. Yeah, I got about a 10 minute drive home, maybe 15 minutes because it's raining really hard and I'm gonna drive slow. I'll be home by nine. Quite wet out. Yeah. Creeks and everything are flooding. Lots and lots of rain. It's warm. It was actually really warm this morning. I was sweating in the barn. And I was, even, I was wearing a t-shirt. Today we're going sleeveless this afternoon. Um, anyway, rain has gone through most of it. Still more rain to come. We did get a tornado watch, so they're keeping an eye on that. But pretty much the storms have petered out and there's not really much expected. But still keeping an eye out there. A lot of creeks and rivers are flooding. So that's about the most of it. All right, getting ready for round two here. I'll see you guys in a bit. All righty, on to the next farm. All righty, on my way home. Finished up a double shift. Man, it was a long day. And I am really hungry, and I am ready to lay down in the couch on, on on the couch yeah guys it is a day later and yeah um all the weather people they hyped the storm up so much nothing happened the only thing that happened was a lot of rain and you saw that um i was expecting big strong storms there we had tornado watch we had a lot of stuff going on it was, it was they were hyping it up big time nothing ever happened which i guess is a good thing because what happened in or where it was georgia and alabama and louisiana i mean that's terrible stuff and you never want to see that. So I guess we were spared. God spared us on this one. Anyway, nothing happened. That's all basically what I need to say. In other news, the hay supply is dwindling. 